Hi, this is Annette with digitalphotographyhowto.com and today I'm going to teach you how to change the layout and template of your blog. So first what you'll do is you'll come to your dashboard, you'll go to www.blogger.com and you it should bring you right to your dashboard after you sign in. Um, if not, then up here by your email address you can click dashboard. So from here you'll go to the blog you want to edit and down in the right hand corner you'll click layout and then you're going to click on edit HTML right here up at the top. Now you're going to go to a website called Pyzam. So we're going to open up a new tab. Um, in order to open a new tab you just come up here to file, new tab and it brings you to a, to a new fresh web page. So I already have Pyzam open in a different tab so I'm going to close that and we're going to come over here and click on Pyzam. Now over in the left hand corner you'll click Blogger Layouts. They also have widgets that are just fun little extras that you can add to your blog and um, I'll show you how to do that on a different tutorial. But okay we're waiting for the Blogger Layouts it will bring down a drop down menu. With Pyzam you always have to make sure that you scroll down because everything that you're wanting to look at is down farther because they have a bunch of ads up at the top. So because we're doing a preschool website, we're going to choose cartoons. We're going to see if they have a Winnie the Pooh. Also, you can search right here for Winnie the Pooh um, in blogger layouts and click search and it will bring up anything that has to do with that. But see, I'm scrolling down so I can see the, these are the different layouts that you can choose from right here and they show you the rating and how many how many times um, that layout has been downloaded. So you can see how popular it is. Um, I'm going to click like on page four. See, there's a bunch of different pages. You can search by color or pattern. You can search flowers. There's a bunch of different things to search. So you can look over here. There's um, there's guy stuff, gray color, green color, girly, general, football, flowers, fashion, dark, celebrities, cartoons. There's just a bunch of different ones that you can choose from by the theme. Okay, so it brought us to our new page, so we're going to scroll down. I don't want any of those, so we'll go to page five. And we'll scroll down and here is a Winnie the Pooh template so we'll just click on that template and it will bring it up in a new page it will show it to you bigger and then you can copy the HTML code okay now we're going to scroll down and there it is right here you can see all the keywords if you need to find it again. Um, you just click right in this box that says get the code. You click right in it one time and then you right click and you're going to choose copy. Okay, And then you're going to go back to your blogger page and right here you can see that there's an, a big box with HTML code. You're going to highlight all of it. I always just go to the bottom and wiggle my mouse in it usually copies it faster. You're going to click backspace or delete then you're going to right click inside and click paste and it will automatically paste the Pooh Bear template. You can preview it to make sure that it works you know that it's that it worked and that it's right. Um, I usually just click save template. and then it says your changes have been saved so you're going to click view blog and you can see that it changed the the layout of my blog to a Winnie the Pooh. Now when you scroll up and down on the blog um, only the yellow boxes move. The picture of Winnie the Pooh and Tigger and Piglet they just stay there and you can see that the yellow is a little bit see-through so you can still see the picture underneath it um, and then 
that is all. That's all. That's how you change your layout. If you want a new one, you just right up here, you can click on Pyzam again and um, pick a different one and replace the HTML code. It's just that easy. Come back and I will teach you how to change your page elements on your blog.